Well, I stop here to do a card pull and it is so windy. <laughs> it's really pretty, but it's really windy. You can hear the flags flapping around from inside the car with the windows up. Windows are up. That one's down like about a quarter of an inch for air. <laughs> but you can hear it. It's really windy. So. Um, so I went for a drive today and before work. And because this is a beautiful day, so why not, right? Got to get myself out of the house every now and then. <laughs> Force myself to go out sometimes. Anyways, um, on a work day, I tend to just stay home and then go to work when it's time to go to work. So let me undo my seatbelt here. So today I'm going to pull a card from this deck that I'm not that familiar with at all. It's pretty newish to me. Kyle Gray's deck. And it is Angels and Ancestors Oracle Cards. So let's see. What kind of a message we have from this windy spot. <laughs> there we go. Oh. Winter, take care of your needs. I had that card come up recently as well. So I'm going to go to the book. So just bear with me a moment. Just got the book here and it says winter. I'm going to take my sunglasses off. Excuse me. I had to put them on today because, well, I got a package from Pure later yesterday and from my work and uh, new equipment. And when I opened it, I, I rubbed my eye and now I've got something going on with my eye. <laughs> So that's why the sunglasses. But anyways, I'll take them off to read. I can, I can still read. <laughs> so it says, do everything you need to be at your best. Then move beyond your fears and limitations. For many of the animal realm, winter is a time of hibernation and retreat. You may wish to curl up in a ball too. It's kind of like me not wanting to go outside just because it's a work day, right? <laughs> so... Uh, you may wish to curl up in a ball, but although you may not feel as bright as you'd like to be, a primal force within is encouraging you to continue, right? So get out there. <laughs> so the winter card features a wolf, one of the few animals that stay active all year round. Wolves know what it's like to work alone or thrive within a pack. So if you feel you need to go it alone at this time know that wolf medicine will help you move beyond your insecurities and relax in your own space so you have an opportunity this is the extended message in this book so you have an opportunity to move beyond your fears and although you may feel in the dark get comfortable with being in the unknown and trust that the light within you will sustain you through what may seem like a challenging process Ask yourself what you need to do to feel supported and alive. You may uncover something from your past that you've buried deep. Know that when you unearth it and shed light on it, you create space for miracles. This isn't the first time the word miracle has come up lately. So you may feel like a lone wolf right now, but it's time for you to be the alpha. When the winter card arrives in the future position of a spread or in the last card of a reading, it can also indicate that in that the coming winter will usher in important energies with regards to your questions or intentions. So if you had a question when you came here and saw this video today, <laughs> then this message could absolutely be important for you. So that's the wolf card. Winter, taking care of your needs. So I hope that that message reaches you when you need to hear it the most. And hopefully my eye will heal quickly. I'm trying to take my best care of it. So I wish you many blessings and I hope you have a beautiful day. And uh, let me again. Oh, it's so windy here. So windy. So this is at the border between Nova Scotia and New Brunswick. And there's beautiful gardens and everything there to look at if you stop along the way. So take care and I'll see you again soon.